Hey guys, welcome back to Fixing It, and today we're gonna change the gimbal bearing on this Scallywag. All right, first thing we gotta do is take out the uh, the drive. And he's just taking this stuff apart. So, in case you wanna know what happens when your gimbal bearing goes bad, usually you get a grinding noise every time you turn. This is so bad now. He gets a you get a noise all the time, right? Yeah, it's chattering. I don't know if it's the bellows or it came through the gasket. Hmm. Tell you what, that's what killed the bearing. Yep. <laughs> Absolutely. It's only a little bit of water if it was. Oh, could have been this year. When the gasket was kinked up. Um, yeah. Ugly looking. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Seal that goes, uh, you know. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know. <laughs> For the uh, the uh, gimbal bearing seal. It seals the transom off from the back of the boat. The shaft goes through it. Okay. Always is. All right, guys, this is a gimbal bearing seal. Notice there's no rubber left. This is a new one. So this part is all rubber. That's it. We're gonna try to put it in with this. It's the only thing that'll fit nice over it. So. And it goes in like that. Nice. 
I like. Oh, that's what it's supposed to look like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice. Now, let me show this is clean where the gasket goes. And in here where your seal goes. Yeah, the rubber seal is going to go in there. We'll get okay. to that later. And then uh, he's going to grease up this the seal before we put on the bearing. All right, guys, that's the gimbal bearing, part number. He got some uh, adhesive and he has the uh, gasket kit for the Alpha, Alpha One drive. Okay, before you put the bearing on, make sure you line up this, because this thing spins. Show them how to spin. Yeah, so make sure that part, the whole lines up with the grease fitting on the side. Well, the grease where it comes in there, it comes in on an angle, so you gotta find Yeah, it. it's right here. This side thing's so. See where the grease coming out? Came out. Yep. All right, the bearing is there, ready to get banged in. And uh, we happen to have a friend that has a custom-made tool. This thing works perfect. You just gonna line it up with the splines there, bang it in. So I don't know. You you might need to improvise and do uh, something else, but. This thing works nice. Now it's in there flush, yeah. Okay, what are you doing now? Bellows adhesive on this seal. Alright, you got the seal put on. Now what? You gotta clean the drive? Yeah. U-joints? Jo U-joints, yeah. They're gonna need to be replaced next year, but I'm just trying to use the boat for next weekend is Labor Day. Yes. So One more weekend. Doing a quick fix. Before the winter. <laughs> Haven't done any repairs at all this summer on this boat, so it's the first one. I have to take it all back apart anyway, but get the last week of the summer out of it. Yeah. Ah! Putting your rubbers on. Yep. Make sure to put grease on them before you put it back in. Yeah, the whole shop gets grease before you put them in. Now he's put the rubbers on, now he's greasing his shaft. <laughs> You're doing a good job with it. <laughs> no, a thing or two about the shaft. <laughs> All right, is she ready to go in? Pretty much. All right, just gotta glue the other o ring to the bell house. That's right, we gotta you have to glue this o ring right here with the gasket. Got a little overselling with the glue. Ah. Gorilla snot, you always get it on you one way or another. All right, before you put this in, make sure you lock the, what are you locking? 
and slide this till it's straight and that'll lock the drive and forward okay. prop will lock out to the left okay so you better make sure the the prop is locked to the left what happens if you don't do that you won't get gears right nope you'd be fucked now take it all back over again and start over yeah geez all right because it needs to be lined up with the bottom of this there's a groove in here okay that's this the shift selector there all right let's throw this on All right, we messed around with it for a little while, but finally it went in. Just keep got to got to put pressure on this while you turn the the, the 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 prop a little bit, and finally it catches in there. As long as you could get a screw, uh, one of these bolts on, um, start it, it'll suck it in. Right, guys that's how you do a gimbal bearing on the alpha drive i hope this video helped you out like and subscribe talk to you guys later take care